Hi folks, welcome back to my channel, hope you're all doing well. Um, I'm back, I'm back vlogging um, after a week of not doing any of the video, any videos because I was uh, I was mega ill um, all week last week. I was coughing, I was sniffing, I just wasn't well at all. Um, I had the shivers as well and this the, the cold weather's not helping at all. I've got my gloves on today as well. I'm just waiting for a tram at the moment, they're, they're taking a the piss at the moment. Um, I've, stood it, I've been waiting for like half an hour. And there's already like three trams already up there. Um, so yeah, I'm just waiting for a tram at the moment. So um, yeah, I'm gonna go to, up to pet, up to pets at home as well to get something for my hamster. Um, there's, a, there's a tram coming up, so I shall catch you. Next Okay, folks, so um, <clears throat> while, while I've got you whilst it's quiet, um, I'm just waiting for the tram at the moment. Um, it's going itself into Blackpool. Um, it is quite cold tonight, but I do have my scarf and gloves and, and hand stuff to keep keep me warm. Um, but I was in pets at home um, earlier on. Um, by the way, this, this is a uh, Fleetwood Ferry, if, you, if you're wondering. Where I am, <laughs> just waiting for my tram to pop up. But um, yeah, I was in Pets at Home early one, and these um, this group of like it was like these two women, these two women and a young lass was in there shopping for hamsters flies because it sounded like they were get they were like getting a hamster or the the fairly new hamsters and stuff, and they saw these hamster leashes um in Pets at Home um because they did have them on. They, they were like hamster leads, you know, like you put on hamsters um. To, like take them for walks and stuff and I was thinking um they were saying now oh, shall we get a lead for a hamster and take it out for a walk and, I, and I'm stood there thinking have you, have you heard yourself you don't you don't put a hamster on a lead that's the worst possible thing that you can do because it's not only that it's um not only are you uh restraining the hamster um you are obviously doing it more harm than good um because you obviously I've seen hamster leads before around the internet and stuff and people actually do use them for some unknown reason but it's just ridiculous um, I thought um, but I, th I, just, I just sort of stood down thinking have you heard yourself and why the heck would you get a hamster lead because they were selling in, in uh, pets at home I think it's only for Syrian hamsters though but um, regardless of what species or what, what the hamster is um, you should basically never put a hamster on the lead anyway because it's, it's restraining their own freedom. So, um, yeah, I'm just um, just waiting for the tram at the moment. So, um, I shall see you folks uh, in Blackpool. There's the moon up there, by the way. Shining bright. It's a clear night tonight as well. There's hardly any clouds. And it's been dry all day. So, I'll see you in Blackpool. Yeah, who, who would put a hamster on the lead anyway? It's crazy. They shouldn't really be selling the leads really for the hamsters, but uh, who who would buy one anyway to put a hamster on the lead? Okay, folks. So I just made it into Blackpool. Um, the star flyer, uh, the star flyer looked like it was stuck at the top. It's on its way back down at the moment now. Um, just outside North Pier here. The, the, they're playing Christmas music so I've got to be careful with uh, copyright but the Starfly was just um, Starfly was just stuck up the top but I was just on my way um, on the tram 
Yeah, I was just I was just on my way to on the way on the tram then, and I just I started to feel um, I started to feel overwhelmingly tired out. Here's North Pier, by the way. Yeah, I started to feel overwhelmingly tired out and just really, really sleepy. Um, I don't know why. It's because I've been waiting so long for like trams and stuff today. Just one sec. Yeah, it's, be it's because I've been waiting for so long for trams and stuff today to come. Um, they're fixing one of the uh, illuminations. Um, just waiting around for like half an hour. I don't know what's up with the trams and stuff today. I have no idea. Um, but there's North Pier. One of my favourite piers in Blackpool. So, um, yeah, I'm feeling a little bit tired at the moment. But um, I might nip into Primark. Uh, there's no wind hardly hardly tonight or at all tonight. Um, so that's that's good on my side. So, um, yeah, we're just going off a look around uh, Christmas by the sea. Because, uh, you know, with, with being ill for a week, I've not, been, I've not been able to get up here or see anything. There's the tower, by the way. It's in red and white for England because um, England have won a couple of games now, I think. Um, but uh, in the Winter Gardens in the Olympia, do you know where I went for Comic Con? Um, what they've basically done is transformed the Olympia into like um, a football um, like zone. Uh, so it's got fake Astro turf on the floor and stuff. And obviously, when it's all over, all the Olympia will be, it'll be turned back to normal. So, yeah, there's the tower. But yeah, I'm feeling alright. I've just got enough energy. That that McDonald's just gave me a little bit of boost of energy to get me to get me out tonight. But the star flyer is back down. Um, yeah, there's the tower, all in red and white. Um, I need to take a photo. Um, I just I won't be a sec. Yeah, so I've just set aside a tourist information centre at the moment. Um, Look at that tree. That's nice. So if you need any inf info. Um, this is like the place to come in Blackpool, the tourist information centre. There's a wedding chapel where people get married. Um, but yeah, here's the, um, that's the place to come for uh, any information on shows or anything like that. Oh, Colin Birds, free French and food. They just wanted to be in the video, the tits. Um, but yeah, um, here's the beach house as well. Sorry there's been quite a few um, nighttime videos, it's just that I've I've really got no, um, not enough time in the day at the moment. I've got to be careful because they are, they are playing copyright music. Um, yeah, I've got no no time in the day to, to do like a daytime video at the moment because um, I'm sleeping in a lot. I'm, I, I'm trying to catch up on my sleep as best as I possibly can at the moment. So, um, yeah, that's probably why. And then uh, it just gets dark early now, doesn't it? Around like four o'clock, uh, four or five o'clock. Starts got really dark early because um, we are in the dead of winter now. Um, next week we are we are expecting minus degree weather, which should be fun. Um, but yeah, that's a tower in red and white for England. I'm not a massive football fan myself. I don't really follow football, um, but it does look good in all red and white. But I've got my gimbal with me tonight, but I'm not going to use it because uh, I just don't want to be carrying around that around me. Look at how dead it is, it is so dead round here. But yeah, there it is. So uh, what the time is, what I'm thinking about doing now is um, having a look around Primark. I don't really need, need anything from Primark. We'll go through this problem. Yeah, I don't really need anything from Primark. Um, I'll just take a photo. Yeah, um, I don't really need anything from Primark to be honest with you, because um, I've got I got everything uh, like the other week when I went. But I just want to have a, a, a bit of a nosy round. Um, they are still showing the star projection, the projection shows as well. So let's go and have a quick look around the uh, Christmas village. This is on the tower headland, by the way. But yeah, I'll just go and have a quick nosy round and see what's going on. Star flyers going back up as well. I've got to be careful with copyright as well um, around here. Uh, th there's a the, there's the prices if you if you want to. And um, it, 
That was the second bauble as well. It's still clear out here as well, but um, this is Odyssey. So I just took a really good, uh, really good photo at the side of that tree with the with the tower in the background. Um, there is a there is shows going on at the moment, but that is a star flyer. But yeah, here's a uh, Odyssey. The uh, the speakers sound like a, a cinema. These are really big, by the way. Really big.
folks. So uh, the plan is now I'm going to get myself into Primark. Uh, there's the Starfly, by the way. I'm going to go into Primark, see, have a bit of a look around. I'll, I'll look around half an hour before this shuts. So uh, we'll come back onto the headland once I've done. But um, I've took a couple of good photos tonight, so I'm not that bothered. Um, but yeah, this is Odyssey. It's pretty big when you actually stood up, uh, stood up, like you know, when you when you stood next to it in person, it's pretty big. But um, yeah, there's a the tower. There is projection shows going on at the moment, so I shall see you folks when I get out of Primark. Alright folks, so it turns out Primark is actually shut. Um this one minutes, there we go. Yeah it is shut. Um I'm not sure why because it's it's open, it's open till seven o'clock at night, but I've just witnessed some kids smashing up against a, a billboard. I'm not sure whether to tell someone about it because that's criminal damage that. Uh, they smashed the plastic bit of the, the billboard. It's ridiculous. You see, it's basically one of these that they just they've just smashed. I'm not sure where to ring the police. Because they they've just kicked it in back there. Why do kids have to damage shit? It's stupid. But this is Bank K Street, by the way. Um, I'm not sure what to do now. I don't think I can get in through the Hounds Hill way, because Hounds Hill's, uh, Hounds Hill's short. There's the Tower Dungeons, by the way. I used to be scared walking past this every time, because there used to be actors out, out here on Bank K Street. Um, that that would like, basically scare you. But um, I don't need a hot drink. I don't need a Mackey's. I'm 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 fed and watered, so I'm 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 good to go. But yeah, they've just smashed the. Book. I can't believe they've just smashed the, the billboard. I might I might tell someone. So. Okay, folks. So I'm just up at Central Blackpool. I don't know, well, Central bit of Blackpool. Uh, I just wanted to give you a bit of an update on the multi-story car park that they are. Uh, building. Um, I just told someone about them kids smashing the billboard, and they just said it's basically they said it's like nothing to do with them. And it's uh, it's the council, and they said um, they, they were fairly like polite and stuff. And I just I just told them, and yeah, I don't know why kids just get a kick out of trashing things. To be honest with you, but um, yeah, this is a multi-story car park. It looks like there's one, two, three, four, five floors to this. Uh, flat, uh, five stories. Sorry. God, it is quite, they've got on with this. Jesus Christ. My nose is starting to run as well. But look at this. New multi-story car park. Um, I'm not sure how many spaces it's, it's going to have. I think it's like over a over thousand spaces this thing's going to have. We'll just have a bit of a wander over. It's pretty dead tonight as well. But look at this. Look how far they've gotten on with this. Yeah, it's going to have like one, two, three, four, five uh, floors to this. They've gotten on with this fast, haven't they? Since I was last here. Since I was last here, the, uh, none, of, none of this was all here. There we go, it's six focus now. Yeah, none of this was all here. There's, there's the stairs and stuff. So they've got all the stairs built in for the multi-story uh, multi car park. But they've, got on, they've gotten on with it pretty fast. There's the moon up there as well. There is frost around that moon as well. God, I can't believe they've gotten on with that so fast. But let's go and uh, we'll go towards the Golden Mile, shall we? Have a look through there. Need to be careful because this is a car. This is an active car park, and cars do come down here still. So I do need to be careful. So when I get back to the Golden Mile, I'll get back. To Okay, folks, so I'm just back down the side of the Hounsfield shopping centre here. Um, there's a body shop with a tower in the background. Um, the Winter Gardens is actually behind me. Uh, so there's the Winter Gardens. Um, as I was saying at the, at the start of the video, they have transformed the Olympia into a... Uh, it is for the World Cup. Uh, I'm not a massive fan of the World Cup, personally. Um, they have transformed the Olympia into like a football... Um, sort of like a football fan like stage thing 
Um, well, there's a stage in there for the big screen to go on, and then there's um, obviously all the other people that are inside there, but that's only until the 18th, 18th of uh, December. There's, there is a sign outside. It is open quite late, because I think there's a football match on at 7 o'clock tonight. The moon's up there, it has hard frost around it, it looks like, so... Um, yeah, it will be. It'll, it'll go. It'll go back to normal. Uh, the Olympia is where the Comic Con Comic Cons held. Um, the ones that I went to. Do you, know, do you know on the on the weekends these lights look nice? You can see them all twinkling. Um, but once the football, the World Cup stuff is over, the Olympia will be turned back to normal, back to how it was when I went to Comic Con and stuff. So yeah. So that's kind of a, a, a wander around. There's the Hounslow Shopping Centre. That's one of the entrances. Uh, and I usually go in there. Um, but it's it's quite it's still quite chilly tonight. But um, shame Primark's not open because I would have gone in there for a little bit of warmth. But it is it is quite dead tonight, so um, my nose is running. My nose is running like a river again. But yeah, it's been it's been not too bad tonight. Just show you the Hounds Hill as well, because um, these lights look nice. Look at this. And you've also got um, the the balls and stuff. There is people in there cleaning at the moment. They've got all the balls and stuff. Um, there's Victoria Street Market, by the way. So yeah, I ordered one of my Christmas presents uh, last night as well, so that's coming tomorrow. Um, as well as a, um, as well as the dark, I, I ordered a dark crystal figurine that I've been wanting for a while, as well. Um, it's but the, the dark crystal is probably one of my favourite, um, one of my favourite Netflix series. If you've not watched the dark crystal, give that a go. But. Um, yeah, we're just coming up back onto Bank Hay Street at the moment, then we'll go, we'll go back onto the prom. Because I'm not quite done with this vlog yet, so... I want to try and make it a little bit of a long one, but... Um, just sort of give you a bit of an update on the... on where the... Um, the Golden Mile is moving to. So, here it is, all the scaffolding has been stuck off as well. Here's the other, other end of uh, Bank Hay Street with all the Christmas lights. But, um, this is where the Golden Mile will be moving to. This is the old Woolworths building. They've actually knocked it out, they've got all the escalators and stuff still in there though. Um, but yeah, let's go back onto the promenade, shall we? And um, I shall catch you all there. Right, folks. <coughs> so, there's uh, the star flyer with the tower. Just thought we're going to have a quick note here on the Golden Mile. It's so dead around here, so I can get as much film as, uh, filming done as I can. I'm so sorry about the auto focusing. My, street, my phone camera really struggles at night time. I need to be careful as well because I've just gotten over a cold for that for that full week. Um, I'll just give you a bit of a rundown of basically what's happened. There's a car coming on that taxi. No. Um, so I we'll think it was last Sunday. Uh, I think it was. Is that a Tesla? No, it's not. I saw a really nice Tesla today as well, uh, whilst in Cleveland. So basically, what happened was um, on Sunday night, um, last Sunday, I think it was. What day are we on today? Tuesday. So for the full week, I was I was ill for the full like the entire week last week. Um, I was coughing, I was sniffling, uh, like I was doing like like I'm still doing tonight. I wasn't very well like at all. Um, so. It was it was my, my my younger brother who actually gave me the cold, um, so I wasn't I, I I had had any energy to do anything at all last week. I just wanted to like go to sleep um, all at all last week. I just uh, I just couldn't like be bothered uh, like doing anything at all last week, so. I was sat on my desk, I was coughing, coughing like, like mad. The big wheel's not on, by the way. Um, yeah, I was coughing like mad um, all week. Well, from, for like, for like four or five days, I think I was coughing. Uh, there's a sea life centre, by the way. And there's the golden mile. Um, if it'll focus on it, you're gonna focus. Because there was a car coming. 
while it's turning. Doesn't really seem to focus properly at night time, does it, my phone camera? But, um, yeah, basic, basically I was coughing and that a lot last week. I had no energy at all. I didn't want to do anything. And when I was downstairs at night time, I just wanted to fall asleep. Um, just one sec. Okay, yeah, so that, that should be better. But uh, well, I was down, I go downstairs at like midnight just for a bit of an hour to myself. Um, because I share a room with my younger brother, um, but obviously we have, we have our own personal spaces and stuff. <laughs> it's a big, big double bedroom. Um, he's the one that gave me the cold. Now my sister's got it, she was coughing and she was trying to make herself sick last night as well. Um, I don't know why, but I told her to, to like stop it because she would have made herself sick otherwise. Um, but yeah, I just... Um, I just basically go downstairs like every night, midnight, to have a bit of an hour to myself. Um, and I was just feeling really tired out and I just didn't want to do anything. That's why I took a week off not uploading any videos at all on YouTube. Um, I might turn around here actually because I want to go to St John's Square and then I want to go to the Corp as well for a couple of chocolate bars. But um, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll turn back around here. Um, yeah, that's basically what happened. My phone camera is really struggling tonight, isn't it? Um, but yeah, I just wanted to give you a bit of an update, really, on um, sort of why. Um, I know I don't really owe, owe anyone an explanation as to why I didn't really upload for an entire week, but um, the, when I didn't, that got so pissed. When that, I, I needed that week to sort of reset and, uh, you know, got myself better for us so I could start making any more like uh, videos and stuff because I've been wanting to make this I've been wanting to make this video for like a, a few days now um, but I just wanted to get myself better but I just need to be careful not to get, not to get a second cold because uh, I've still got sniffles and stuff but um, my sister's one of those that just, just won't cover her mouth when she's, when she's coughing um, she just won't cover her mouth when she's coughing like at all so um, yeah, I just thought I'd give you a tell you uh, why this sort of wasn't. I didn't do any videos. Um, obviously, it's my channel. I can take my time with it and stuff like that. So, um, you know, um, I've I've not really got much planned in the way of Christmas uh, Christmas content either. Uh, this throughout the of December, other than these like um, this is gonna be like the first vlog, uh, vlogmas vlog that I'm gonna be doing through December. Um, but I'm more than I'm more than like likely do a few more Christmas vlogs and stuff like that throughout like December and stuff but I've not really got a heck of a lot um, of like videos and stuff planned at the moment I know other creators do actually have um, plans and stuff for Christmas um, by the way there's the Golden Mile um, this whole building it will be moving up, up to up to there where I showed you earlier on um, so all this is going to be knocked, knocked down for the development that's happening at the moment um, but yeah, I needed that week off last week to sort of reset and get myself better and um, I've been sort of focusing on my sleep and stuff more which is good so yeah, I've missed vlogging as well, I just I just miss talking to her to my phone camera and stuff so um, and I know, I know I have you folks for your support and stuff and I really do appreciate that and especially on my, my Christmas by the sea vlog as well um, I really do appreciate the support on that vlog because that was the biggest Blackpool vlog I've done this year, like, no, no joke, that was the biggest Blackpool vlog I've ever done uh, this year, so thank you so much, um, I know I saw you a lot, and I really do appreciate that, and, um, you know, I'm no big, I'm no big creator like these uh, other bigger creators are, I just want the views and stuff all the time, I just film because I simply enjoy filming and taking you folks along on with these little adventures that I'm doing as well. So, thank you so much. You're all heroes for sticking around and wanting to support me with these videos and stuff. And yeah, there's a fire engine coming up. But yeah, let's go to St. John's Square, shall we? So we can have a walk through that big giant bauble. No, no, it's not, it's not a fire engine. It's an ambulance. Oh, I've got a tissue with me tonight as well because my nose is like running so bad. Yeah. An ambulance. So let's go to St John's Square, shall we? I've been debating whether to go in this this star flyer, you know. Like seriously, debating to go in it because um, it's only six 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 quid a ride, which I thought was a little bit steep. To be quite honest with you, six quid a ride, um, especially if you if your kid wants to go in it a few times, 
Well, if you want to go in a few times. What's that? If you want to go in it like twice, it's like 12. If you want to go in it tw three times, it's like, what, 16, is it? 16, 17 quid, which is a little bit steep, but as long as people enjoy it, then that's the main thing, isn't it, really? So, I shall see you folks actually in St. John's Square. Okay, folks, so I just made to see St. John's Square. It is getting quite busy now because the football just started. But look how nice the, the front of the Winter Gardens looks with all the decorations on it. I, I'd zoom in, but my fingers were on it. Yeah, I've not got a thing, uh, touchscreen gloves on, but there's a Christmas tree. Um, yeah, it's just, I, th uh, I think, I think the, fo the fo football's starting soon, so that's, that's why it's getting uh, a little bit busy. Um, the Winter Gardens is open until late tonight anyway. But um, let's just have a walk through there. Yeah, look how nice this looks. But yeah, this is St John's Square. Let's have a quick look at the Christmas tree as well, because uh, I didn't get a close-up of that last time. There's taxes and everything pulling off here. Uh, yeah, the, fo the football's just starting. I'll be glad when this football thing's over so the Winter Gardens can get back to normal, to be honest with you. There is a projection thing on the St John's Square Church as well. This tissue is uh, run its course now because my, my nose is starting to really run like mad now. But yeah, here's St John's Square Christmas tree. Looks pretty nice actually. But yeah, I'm not sure how many much how much more I'll film tonight. Um, I'm just see see what's going on. I'm gonna go to co-op now and get, uh, see if I can get. I'm gonna get myself a pack of tissues and to swap some money over from my bank though from my savings. So I'm gonna do that now. Get myself some tissues because my nose is running like mad. Get myself some two chocolate bars for when I get back, uh, get back home as well. And then we'll just. Uh, I've finished on Promenade now, so uh, we'll probably stick to the town centre stuff. Uh, there's the West Coast Rock Cafe, by the way, over there. West Coast Rock Cafe do the best burgers, by the way, um, in Blackpool, I reckon. I went in there with my mate and his mum one time. Best burgers in Blackpool they do, uh, West Coast. And they play some good music as well, um, especially like Maroon 5, because I'm, I'm, I'm a big Maroon 5 fan, me. me. Big Maroon 5 fan. Um, I've, all, I've, I've listened to that music for quite some time now and I just love the band, so... Yeah, that's the Winter Gardens. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go to the cop now and get myself some tissues, tissues and I'll get back to you. I don't wanna see it anymore. <laughs> I don't wanna see it anymore. Matt, you think you prefer sweet? You prefer, he's gonna, he's gonna stick with sweet. Say goodbye to everybody while we're on. Blackpool Illuminations Christmas, play with it. Bye bye everybody, bye bye. Thanks Matthew. Thanks everybody. Thanks everybody. Thanks everybody. Okay folks, so I am going to end this video here. Yeah, I'm just going, I'm going to end this vlog here. Um, I hope you all enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed filming it for you all. Um, yeah, take care and I shall see you folks uh, in my next video.